Hey Achievers, how is everybody doing? So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how do you use Merchant Words to do your product research because I think this is an amazing tool and it's very cheap and it gives you tons of product ideas if you use it right. So without any further ado, let's get into the video and I'm going to keep this short and trimmed, just talk to the point, not really get out of the scope and just show you exactly how you can use Merchant Words. All right guys, but before we get into the video, I would really appreciate if you could hit that like button at the end if you find value in this video. If you're new to this channel, welcome. I really appreciate that you found this channel. I'm so glad that you're here. I would love if you watch it till the end and, and I would really, really be happy if I can provide some value to you guys. So please hit the subscribe button and ring the bell and I will come back to you with another video tomorrow or day after tomorrow or as soon as possible actually because I just want to give you give you all lots and lots of value so without any more further boring discussions let's get in the video and we will stick to the point promise you that alright guys we are now in my computer screen as you can see I just want to check if it's recording because I have had a lot of tragedies before so yeah uh, we are in my computer screen as you can see I am on the Merchant Words website now This is a pay tool, but it is as good as free because it just costs you $9.99 Which is a very very small teeny tiny amount that you want to pay because if you have If you're doing this business and if you're already in your product research phase yourself You must have bought Chrome extension and all those uh, research tools which are quite expensive. So this is $9.99, nothing, nothing next to all of those different tools that you might have to buy if you want to start this business or if you're already doing this. So yeah, uh, what Merchant Word is, is basically it's a software which tells you exactly what customers are searching for for a related keyword. So for example, let's say you were looking for a kitchen knife. Now there could be different kinds of kitchen knife. There could be a big kitchen knife, small kitchen knife, small, double sided kitchen knife. I don't know what the heck. Uh, so there could be all of these different kinds of kitchen knives. But if kitchen knife is something that you wanted to sell, but you wanted to sell something which has less of a competition, for example, a pocket kitchen knife might have less competition as compared to a general kitchen knife but how do you get to this idea how do you get a uh, pocket kitchen knife as an idea in your head it were it wouldn't just occur to you so to to get just so to get such weird product ideas which might be related to your original product idea but are a better bet because it's just not very popular it might have less competition it might have more margins at times it might be much more niche specific so just to get those product ideas merchant words is the best tool now it does two things for you first it will give you product ideas second it will also help you gauge the market depth it will give you a number uh, which will basically give you an idea as to how many times a certain phrase or a keyword is being searched on amazon.com which is absolutely fantastic because if you know a keyword is being searched a lot on amazon.com that means it has demand right what the heck it's so obvious so yeah let's get in the research mode and let me show you if you wanted to search for kitchen knife what i would do here is just go ahead and type kitchen knife and then let, let's let's see what pops up so when you type in kitchen knife now oh, okay wow i might have six cents so this just popped up uh, you can see here it says pocket knife now that's a different kind of knife it's not a kitchen knife oh I think I think I just typed in I think I just typed in knife knife now that is absolutely hilarious why would I do that okay what the heck let's just type knife and see what happens so when you type in knife you get something like pocket knife now wow look at this it has 1.4 million estimated search volume now make sure that you really pay attention to this three letter word here which says estimated now these are not the exact number of searches that happens on Amazon because only Amazon knows that nobody else knows that and Merchant Woods is not an Amazon company so they are just they only have estimated data based on some formulas they might be running in the back end but, but don't go uh, don't go by the numbers just take them as a grain of salt actually just help take them take these numbers to help you navigate 
uh, just like the North Star does but don't go by the number but you can definitely say that the pocket knife but it can help you relatively identify what's searched more so pocket knife keyword is definitely being searched a lot more than Swiss Army knife it's definitely sure uh, it's definitely clear because if you see Swiss Army, Swiss Army knife has about 360k searches and pocket knife has 1.4 million searches which is absolutely I think more than three times of it so yeah so that can kind of gives you an idea as to what's being searched by how much more so that's the way I use merchant words I don't really depend on their search data search volume data because that might not be correct but relatively it gives you a lot of good insights but again I'm sorry let's stick to the point so pocket knife here it this is a different kind of knife that you might not have even thought about so what you can do here what you can do here is actually just hover over this search icon and it's going to show you search on Amazon. When you click on search on Amazon, it's going to directly take you to Amazon.com with the search term pocket knife and it's going to show you exactly what people are looking for, looking at when they type in this keyword. Now, once you're on this page, you can apply all the different filter techniques that I talk about in other videos and my ebook, which actually is going to tell you if this pocket knife is a good product idea to begin as an Amazon FB product or not. So I'm not going to talk about those filter techniques in this video. We are just exploring motion words and figuring out how do we use it to get more product ideas. Now if you move down in this list, it says knife set. Now that is another different, that is something, uh, inter that's, that's something interesting actually because you see people are searching for knife sets and it's a quite it's quite a big number and it has quite big numbers here 600k 600,000 searches for knife set now so that means that people are interested in knife set so but but I'm sure that this night this might not be a good idea because uh, it might be very saturated and it might have a lot more competition and you just won't be able to get into it so let's just skip that let's move down the list because we have very high numbers here I think knife is quite popular among Americans. I guess it's popular all over the world. Who doesn't love to cook? But anyways, okay man, this one looks interesting. You see, you would have never thought about selling a hunting knife. Now, I'm not even sure if that's a real differentiated product, but let's go ahead and check it out. All right, all right. All right, this looks different. So this looks like a multi-purpose uh, kind of uh, knife, which people might use when they go camping. I think it's going to be very strong and sturdy, and it might be used for uh, different purposes. So that's another product that you might uh, be able to sell, which is not a kitchen knife, but it's a knife of a different kind. So let's 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 find one. Let's do one more. Scroll down in the list, scroll down in the list. All right, I see electric knife now. Oh, wow. I have never seen electric knife. What the heck is that? All right. Electric knife. Okay. Okay, that's a totally new beauty of product. I have never. So this is something that I, that I just found out with you guys right here. I've never seen or even heard about electric knife like I wouldn't even imagine why would a knife be electric but I think this is kind of popular because it has a lot of reviews over here all right so you get the point right so that was the idea guys I just wanted to show you how do I use merchant words to get new product ideas now some of these product ideas uh, might be might be great some of these might just not be good enough you can run the numbers on them. You can use your Jungle Scout Pro extension and figure uh, how are the numbers on them. Do they have good competition? Do they have enough margins? Do they have enough sales on a monthly basis? And all of those things will decide whether you actually did find a good product or not. But, but, but the goal was to get more product ideas and that's how Merchant Word helps me. That's how Merchant Words can help you to get more product ideas outside uh, outside your knowledge base something that you might not be thinking of uh, so just all you have to do is just go ahead and put in your root keyword in machine words and it will show you exactly what are the other things that people are searching on amazon.com using the keyword that 
uh, you in, enter in. So yeah, that was it guys. This was uh, a very quick video for you guys. I just did not want to leave you hanging. I wanted to keep this these videos coming for you guys so that I give you a lot of value and uh, you find value in my channel. So if you like this video, hit that like button, smash that subscribe button and ring a bell because I just love bells. Ding, ding, ding. It was Christmas already. Ring a bell. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you in the next video. All the best. Cheers. Enjoy and kick ass in February. <laughs>